アートソフトウェアインクファウンダーの CEO 井戸次郎様よろしくお願いいたします。Thank you very much for the kind introduction, Hirai. And it's a true pleasure to be here today. Thank you all for making、uh, the time and coming,、uh, coming up here. So, I think that Hirai gave a great introduction to the API economy and the API marketplace business.、Um, and now I'm going to try to talk a little bit about the history of、uh, our software and Rapid API. But also more broadly about the API economy and how it's developed over the past few years,、um, and explain why we think it's one of the most interesting、um, parts of technology happening right now. So, if we take a, bit, a step back、um, and look at the world more broadly,、uh, there is this saying that says software is eating the world. This is something that we truly believe in, and if we look at the way that we live our life, Software has fundamentally transformed every aspect of it. We no longer take a cab、uh, or hail it in the street. We call it Uber via an application. If you took the train here today, you probably didn't look at the paper map before, and you use Google Maps. And if you need something quickly, you're not going to go to, or you don't have to go to the mall and buy it, but rather you can go on、uh, the Rakuten website and buy it online. So almost every part of our life is now easier because of software. But while software makes our life as consumers a lot easier, actually creating and developing that software is still pretty difficult. There are a lot of different、um, parts and moving systems within the software, and every time they need to be developed from scratch. You need to create things like、uh, user management for that software, you need to create things like payment processing and work with the banks to accept credit cards, you need to add things like messaging and search, and in general, there are dozens of different pieces. That go into every piece of software that is being developed. This makes it really hard to develop software. Firstly, the development time is very long because for every different application or website being built, all of these different components need to be re engineered. It is also very expensive to develop new software because you need to hire new developers and give them tools to rebuild those different components. And after that software is developed, it is also very difficult to maintain because all these different pieces of code need to be kept up to date. So, yeah, altogether developing software is still pretty hard. And that really slows down innovation、um, and the creation of new transformative technologies. And when we look at our mission at Rapid API, and I feel like now it's a mission that we share with Rapid as well, we want to empower developers all around the world. To create transformative applications and companies. And to do that, we need to give them better tools to develop software. And that is exactly what APIs do. So, if we look back at all the moving pieces and all the logic that goes into that application, a lot of these individual pieces are actually pretty generic and are pretty common between applications. So, if you think of email, for instance, you probably get an email when you buy something online, you probably get an email when you order a flight ticket. You probably got an email from your calendar with a reminder for this conference today. But the actual delivery of the email is pretty similar. So there could be one API, and there actually is one API, that all those different companies can use to send that email. The same goes for payment processing. You pay for a movie or you pay for an application on the App Store. The actual credit card processing is pretty similar. Same goes for text messaging, and same goes for almost every component that goes into building the application. Those different components or different pieces that developers can reuse, those are exactly the APIs with Rapid. And by using APIs, developers can choose the best of read components to put into their application and mix them together to build a new piece of software. The benefits of using APIs are pretty abundant. A, it yields much faster development times because all those different components don't need to be re engineered every time. Instead of spending weeks or even months rebuilding the different software, developers can find an API and consume it online. It's also a lot more cost effective because, again, you don't need to hire developers to re engineer those pieces. And you get much better service because the people who maintain that software are specialized in doing just that. But what excites us the most is the new possibilities opened by those APIs. Today on Rapid, we have APIs for machine learning, for artificial intelligence, 
can put that into unique data sets. And by integrating um, those APIs and capabilities into their applications, developers can actually create much better applications and not just create the same applications faster. So it's no surprise with those benefits that over the past few years, there's been a huge market shift to relying on APIs. And that has actually uh, created multiple billion dollar companies whose sole business is providing developers with APIs. Some examples are Stripe, which is the most popular payment API in the world right now. So when developers want to accept credit card payments, instead of having to go to the banks and secure all the information, um, secure and transmit all that credit card information directly, they can use Stripe and rely on them to do that. Same things for Twilio and Nexmo and Telesign for SMS providers, SendGrid for emails, and many other companies. And in Rapid, uh, we think that with our mission to empower developers to create more transformative applications, APIs are definitely the way. We started working on this project called Rapid about three years ago. And initially it was just a collection, a uh, very static website with a collection of uh, APIs that developers can use. We knew or we saw that APIs can make it more easy for developers to create applications. And we wanted to uh, create a better way for developers to discover those APIs. After we saw that a lot of people were using that website to find APIs and embed them into their applications, uh, we realized that there is an opportunity to build a real company to help facilitate that usage of APIs. We pitched to an investor called Dov Moran in Israel, and he agreed to give us $500,000 to start Rapid API. We used that money to hire the first engineer, productize Rapid, and give better tools for developers to consume APIs. Pretty quickly, really, we realized that back then, a lot of the uh, developers that we initially wanted to work with, and a lot of the APIs as well were in the US. So I moved with a part of the team to Silicon Valley, where we started to grow our developer base of Rapid API. And after two years growing that in Silicon Valley, we raised an additional $12 million from Andreessen Horowitz to keep expanding the Rapid API developer user base. And today, Rapid API is the world's largest API hub where developers can A, discover APIs that they can embed into their applications, consume all of their, those APIs using a unified interface, and we'll soon show what that interface looks like, and lastly, manage and monitor their existing API connections. Over the past few years, we've dramatically scaled Rapid from just a few hundred developers using it to consume APIs to over 500,000 developers using the Rapid API platform today. And we also have the biggest catalog of APIs out there, over 8,000 APIs, including some of the largest brand names and partners, some of which are here with us today, uh, that developers can consume directly from Rapid API. So now, with our mission to empower developers around the world, we're constantly thinking about how we can bring APIs to more and more developers. And when we look at this uh, statistic of where developers are around the world, we say that yes, a lot of them are in the uh, US and in English speaking countries where Rapid API is today. But the second largest market for developers is actually right here in Asia. And a lot of the APIs are very ill adapted for the Asian market today in terms of billing, documentation language, and support. And we think that there is a huge opportunity to bring APIs to those developers out here in Japan and the rest of Asia. And this is why today we're very excited to launch Rapid and Rapid API together with our partners here. APIs are really helpful in helping developers create transformative applications. And we want to get them in the hands of as many developers as possible. And we think that with our new partner, Rakuten, we have another company that really believes in that mission and is willing to put a lot of hard work into making it a reality. Hirai and the rest of the Rakuten uh, team has really helped us create a world-class team of developers and developer evangelists to help us grow Rakuten Rapid API. And we're very excited to launch it today. We can't wait to see what people are going to build with the APIs on Rapid. Thank you very much for listening. API マーケットプレイスビジネス部部長ジェットウンドリー楽天ラピッド API の詳細をご説明いたしますよ
Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for being here today. Rockton Rapid API is the world's largest API marketplace. Our vision is to be the one place where developers come to look for APIs. And this service is launched in an exclusive partnership with Rapid API. And, for, and we've chosen to co-brand the service because we believe in the long-term nature of this partnership. We'll be working to bring Japanese and APAC API providers onto our platform and help them reach a global developer community. We're going to be the single interface, the one stop for API discovery all the way to payment. And we're launching with an API selection of over 8,000 today, which significantly accelerates the scale of our business. Most importantly, we're going to drive the API economy forward by maximizing value for all our stakeholders. This means that for developers, they should pay the same for API services on our platform as they would by going directly. For API providers, we charge you no fixed fees for, uh, for listing or maintenance. In other words, we can only be successful if you are. Let me tell you a little bit more about how we're going to help our API provider partners. As the world's largest API marketplace, we're going to help API providers reach the global developer community. This is something that they typically would not be able to access easily. As developers use your API, you'll be scored based on popularity and usage. And this helps you make, become more visible. For monetization, we let you set pricing plans based on your particular business context. At the end of each month, we calculate transactions, we reconcile them, we manage payments and uh, pay out to you, so you don't have to do it. For community, the platform has 500,000 active developers today and growing fast. It's a significant source of value for all API providers. And the key reason, we have partners like IBM, Microsoft, and Nexo in the room with us today. We're pursuing enterprise deployment, which create opportunities to sell, sell into Fortune 500 scale companies. This helps you eliminate a long sales cycle. And we're convinced that the Rocket 10 Rapid API relationship is going to strengthen the use of this, uh, this user base. For management, API providers will receive a dedicated portal, which will function as their channel to users. We authenticate every user API request for you, and we track this on our analytics dashboard. This gives you the most important insights. For instance, what endpoints are your users using? Which plans are the most popular? And what performance are they experiencing? And we're extremely proud to see API providers already find success on this platform. One example is Skyscanner, which joined us two months ago and has grown all the way from zero to 1.5 million API calls. For our developer users, we're providing a single interface for the entire user journey, from discovery, to usage, to management, and payment. For discovery, we provide the best-in-class API lineup in one place. We're committed to growing this selection for you, and we're working to improve integrations all the time so that they have the best possible experience. We have exclusive APIs that will be found only on this platform and nowhere else. And with unparalleled selection, our message to developers is you have no reason to go anywhere else. But finding an API alone is not that useful. What sets us apart from directories is that we make usage easy and painless. And to achieve this, this strategic partnership is brought to you by three parties which contribute a unique set of values each. Rakuten brings decades of marketplace expertise, 21 years in fact since Ichiba was founded in 1997. Rakuten is a household brand today in the region and we have footprint in Asia to help us scale. 
Rapid API is already the world's largest API marketplace platform, and we're going to grow together even larger now. They'll be providing the core technology for Rock 10 Rapid API. And finally, Rocket Tech Communications has strong experience in new service creation in the ICT industry. They are the perfect organization to drive marketing and business development for us. Today, July 11 mock service launch in Japan, but that's only step one. Our commitment is to be a driving force for the API economy in Asia, the second largest developer market in the world. In order to do this, we plan to expand, expand in the near future. We have an ambitious business target ahead of us. Our goal is to grow to 700,000 new users across APAC within four years. Thank you for being with us here today. Please join us on this exciting journey. Communications, Jeff,